Here's another tip on using your electronic tuner, and this is probably the most important tip I can give you. As I got ready to practice this morning, I played for about three or four minutes, and then I did a tuning note. And here's the note and the tuner. Now, after getting further in my warm-up, another 15 minutes or so, I played another tuning note, and here's that one. It's important that you know I didn't move my tuning slide at all throughout this. It's safe to assume that the pitch was gradually rising on the horn as it warmed up over the 15 minute period. I've seen this scenario play out in both amateur and professional situations where someone plays a tuning note when they're not fully warmed up. They feel pretty good, but the instrument itself is not fully warmed up perhaps. Then as they go into the rehearsal or the performance, their pitch is going to be higher when the instrument starts to get really warm as you really pump air into it. So it's important to notice this. It's important to pay attention to it. You might check yourself in the middle of a rehearsal or during the first break in the rehearsal. Immediately after the break happens, try a tuning note and see where you are right then. You can discover perhaps that your pitch rises 10 cents or 20 cents during that time. And you can also play with your tuning slide to know about how much adjustment you need to make. That can help you be ready for the changes that occur naturally. If you're playing with a fixed pitch instrument like a piano, it's very important to know this. In a band, the rest of the band may be going up or down as you do too. For example, coming back from a break, you're probably all going to be a little flatter than you were before the break and so on. Anyway, it's important to know that as the horn gets warmer, its pitch will go up and it doesn't take that long for it to happen, but it takes longer than just a few minutes as I demonstrated here. I hope you find this helpful in real life. Thanks for listening.